Hey friends, it's Shane from HunterInch.com and I am going to show you a little trick uh, for when you're taking a fuel tank off and it always can be a hot mess and you're spilling fuel and you always say, well man, there's always some fuel in there that you can't get out or you kind of get to the end where there's fuel trapped back here and I have to take off this crossover tube too and I really don't want to you know, have to put a bunch of tiles out and protect it really well so I want to try and get as much fuel out of that tank as I can. So let me show you a little trick that I do. I just take any kind of rag. Now I'm going to try and do this one-handed here. See if I can get make this happen. Just kind of, like I said, stuff that rag around there. And then I'm going to go ahead and just put some real light pressure in the tank. And then what you'll see is you can get the rest of that little fuel out. Now I'm only putting literally a couple PSI. I'm barely pulling that trigger. I'm just forcing a little bit of pressure and look at all this extra fuel that I'm getting out of there. Now you just saw if I let off, it's done. It's it's gonna force you to have to fight and make a mess. So I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna do that until I get no more fuel out. And that my friends is my little trick for uh, actually emptying the fuel tank so you don't have to make such a big mess. There's your tip of the day from HowToRinch.com. Please share, like, subscribe. Buy a t-shirt, sticker, make a donation, anything else, keep our work going. Make it a great day, and as always, keep wrenching. Hey, what are you doing? Have you hit that subscribe button, that notification bell? You're going to be missing out on videos and free prizes and raffles we have coming up.